Jad, you 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 have the challenge of playing a sick man, mm. and you feel quite ill just watching you. Really, Thank I you. mean that coughing. I think, that's a I think do you know the I do you know the secret I sneaky secret rather? Well, I want to know because uh, when you're coughing, there's bits where you can you feel phlegmy listening to yeah, you, and sorry. I was like, <laughs> I was like, do they, do they have to wait until you actually have a, have, have a have a flu? Or do they add the sound afterwards? No, no, I got sick. He actually genuinely got oh, sick. <laughs> I remember being like, this isn't actually fair, right? Because <laughs> I did actually you got it for sick. free. You got it for free. Yeah. You were really just, I just rode the tube. You're going to get sick. If you, if you go on the tube long <laughs> enough, you'll get sick. I sat next <laughs> to everyone. That's a terrible <laughs> advert for London. It's true. Well, particularly at that time of year, you know. Well, you, you, you sit on the tubes and sit next to anyone who's coughing and you know, <laughs> breathe. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Basically, that's, that's he's, what I did. Yeah. I actually started yeah. to get worried that I was going to get better. Yeah. yeah. He kept, he kept saying, saying I'm going to be last. Yeah. I, I never wanted to, to smoke again after seeing you do that. So that's oh. hard. Like you've got cancer mm. and then you're puffing yeah. away. It's rank. Mm. You're both incredibly smartly dressed today, and I've always wondered whether, did you think, because you're playing Royals, you now have to do, you feel like you'd be letting them down if you weren't incredibly dapper? <laughs> or just do you always... I'm, really, I'm quite scruffy in real life. Yeah, I think you've got to represent, you know. Uh, you're always well dressed. Uh, um, I think it would be a bit weird if you showed up in a sort of jeans and a fil filthy T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, 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 you look great. <laughs> The costumes are in the actual show. Yeah. That was no, like next seven, level. I've never experienced anything like it. 7,000 costumes, 350 all oh, yeah. handmade. It's yeah, yeah. quite an undertaking. All of mine were be. handmade, actually. And yeah. there's a nice dignity to that era as well, dressing as well. Yeah. There wasn't scruffy people back in the day. Not at all. No, and they were very, very particular. Some, some people you could get yelled at if you wore, wore the wrong, uh, you know, so there was one story about uh, someone coming in wearing the wrong tartan or something or other, and you got absolutely Didn't like it. bollocked. Yeah. Margaret used to like swish her costumes around. I mean, her clothes around in the in the corridor to check whether they swished right. The thing <laughs> Which about I've never done in my entire the, life. The thing about that is because it sounds superficial, but the thing about it is, is if you imagine who, these people's lives, everything they do is scrutinised mm. and analysed and criticised. So, and, and the uh, and the presentation is massively important. Um, you know, you, they, they have to look it for people to believe they mm. are it. And the interesting thing is there's one scene where Elizabeth is, is I don't know if you've seen this yet, when they, all these women come out, uh, these models come out in the different dresses for the tour that she, they, she may or may not wear. And there's just this girl sitting there, this 26-year-old, just, you can just see that she's not, she would never ask for this. She doesn't want it. It's not like she's pursued it and she's mm. become really well-known and she's into fashion. She's like the opposite of that, wants to be in the country with her dogs and husband and kids and uh that that really struck that sort of presentation mm. that, and sort of what you have to do because you are in the, in the, in the global spotlight it's power fashion's really really powerful and never more so than now it's always been but it's massively powerful yeah you think of what uh and this is slightly off topic but you know um i it, what uh Victoria Beckham did for David Beckham. She she she, she did. She made him the. That's what's up. And that's it. Now we're moving King on. George. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, 